Um, Funzo, before we get into anything else, um, you must have had ice in your veins, 98th minute to step up and do that. What's in your head at that point? Um, just to, to score the penalty. I, I didn't know we were that close to the end of the game, to be fair, that might have helped. But um, it's just one of them. You have to, you have to just step up and um, take responsibility and score it. My teammates helped me by um, protecting the penalty spot. The pitch was already bad enough, and um, they helped me out with that. So thankful to them, and and happy we got a penalty in the end. Yeah, the end of a pretty dramatic week, really, wasn't it? And I suppose that if nothing else, it's it, it, it's it's at least given you a bit of something to build on, hasn't it? Um, yeah, definitely. It's been a, it's been a tough week, especially for me. I was very close with the staff, and um, I had a few tantrums this week on the t training pitch, um, but. It's, it's part of the game, you have to move forward, but I'll, uh, I spoke to the gaffer after I so I said this one was for you. Um, I'm still sad that it's gone, but as I said, we have to move, move forward. Yes, but I suppose when you know, you've know you signed a new contract with, with the manager in the summer and such, then you, you are going to have an affinity with him, are you? But I suppose, like you say, you, you've, you've kind of got to move forward now, haven't you? And you've got to get yourselves out of the situation that you find yourself in towards the bottom, bottom end of the table. Yeah, exactly. And we as a team, we, we sat down and we... We spoke about the, the basics and the fundamentals we need to instill back into the team and, and we're, we're going to build on today and we're just waiting for whoever comes in, uh, if, that, if that's tomorrow, if that's in two, three weeks or if, it, if this is the start until the end of the season, we're, going, we're just going to grind the games out and uh, keep this um, club up. As senior players, I know they've talked about a leadership group that's here before. Is that a big responsibility on you all now to try and you know keep things level-headed while this all happens? Uh, yes, there was a leadership group that sat together first and we just said, like, we're going to do it this way. Everyone can have their opinion outside the leadership group, but um, we're going this direction and you just have to jump on board. For yourself, uh, it's obviously been quite a while since you've been able to start a couple of games now. Mm -hmm. Fitness-wise, how are you feeling? Are you feeling that you, you know, you've still got a bit more to, to get it back up to 100% for you or are you there? No, I was 100% when I started playing a couple of games ago, but it's we just um, getting older, so um, I have to just listen a bit more to the body. And, and um, my kind, who got me through my rehab very well, he, he's protecting me more in when I'm saying I can play 90 and I might have been able to play 90 before, he's, he's just dragging me off earlier. You've got to, I suppose, look after yourself, haven't you? Like you say, you're getting older now. We all are, aren't we? But yeah. that, that's, a, that's just as much of a learning curve for a footballer at this stage of his career as anybody, I suppose. Exactly, yeah. This is definitely a learning curve for me. <laughs> um, overall, though, like you say, it, it is a point. It gives you a bit of a, a platform now to go into a, a really tough sequence of games, doesn't it? Because yeah. Peterborough, Cheltenham, Reading, they're all important ones. They're all teams, with the exception of Peterborough, who are around you. Points are really important now. Yeah, I don't think you can approach any game like, oh, this is going to be an easier one or this is going to be a harder one. They're all hard for us. It's not like um, back in September, October, where, where we had the teams on the rust. They're all, most of them are all above us. So every game is just a grind. And we, um, we're going to try to play from a solid base and protect the nil and uh, try to score from there and get three points. Jason Lowe alongside you uh, today. Um, does that help? You know, both of you have got a lot of games under your belt now. Having that experience in there is going to be really vital, I suppose. Uh, yes, but whoever comes in in the, in the team, if you have four on the games or if you have four games, you just have to step up and, and do your best. And lastly, one last thing for you now. I think that's the second penalty of the season that you've scored against Stevenage. That's third one, yeah, third one even. Yeah. Third one even. You must like it. Um, no, it's something I trained on, like with the guys. I I, I tried to tell the goalie on on uh, when we train on them that I'm going that way, and then it's just up to me to whip it. <laughs>